Yo, I got a question for y'all right now. I got a question for y'all. First of all, it's your boy Aaron speaking. How's my YouTube fam doing today, man? Y'all chilling? So I was on a computer today or whatever, like I always am. And I, was, I don't know, I, I guess this song popped up, Love Sosa, right? And in my head, I'm like, damn, this brings me back. Like this brings me back like so many good memories. You know what I'm saying? Like 2012, I graduated high school. And shit was just lit, you know what I'm saying? And then it kind of came to me like, damn, like, does nostalgia play a huge role in, you know, like, I know music and nostalgia is hand in hand, bro. Hand in hand. I don't think anything besides maybe smell that just brings nostalgia so fast, bro. Like, you ever get that one smell and you just like, damn, like, it just brings you back to like second grade or something. Like, yo, bro, I swear, there's this certain marker I don't know what it is, but there's a certain smell, bro. Every time I sniff that shit or I smell it, it just reminds me of like second grade. Or like Yu-Gi-Oh cards. Like if I open up a pack and I smell the Yu-Gi-Oh cards, it just reminds me of elementary school. You know what I'm saying? Like just certain things bring you back. But my question is, does nostalgia make a song? It's hard to explain. Like, let's say you gotta be objective. Like let's say, let's say you hear a song, right? and you really love it, or at least you used to love it, right? Does nostalgia blind you? Like, is that song really that good or is it just nostalgia? You get what I'm trying to say? Like, if you used to hear a song now, let's say the song came out 2008 or some shit, and you hear it now, like, oh, you know what I'm saying? You like it, you love it, you have a very strong emotional connection to that song, and it brings you back to that year and all the good, fun times. But is the song actually good? You know what I mean? Does, like, I guess the question is, you know, I don't know how to explain it, but it's like, you know, like, let's say my dad, right? Let's say my dad listens to a song. He's mad old school. Let's say he hears a song from like the 60s, right? He's going in, he's jamming to it. But is the song actually good? You know, do you actually really, do you really like the song? Or is it, or does it just bring you back to that time? You know what I'm saying? Cause he be listening to all that shit, 60s, 90s, uh, 70s music. And it's like, do you really fuck with that? Or are you just reminiscing the times? You know what I'm saying? Like, you get what, you get what I'm trying to say? Like, the, like, does nostalgia make a song better than it already is? You know what I'm saying? Like, if somebody new was to hear it, but they don't have any emotional connection to that song, like, they're hearing it for the first time, they probably don't, they probably won't love it as much. You know, if they hear, if they heard a song from, like, 2016 now, but if I heard a song... From that time, I'll be like, damn, good times. You know what I'm saying? But to them, they might not like it. So yeah, does nostalgia make a song better? I don't know. <laughs> yeah, boy, so hold up. up. Your boy got merch, bro. It's in the description. Stop playing. This shit is fire, bro. Boy, and they let them go, boy. Yo, I remember when that shit came out. I remember the snippet, bro. The snippet was harder than the actual song, bro. For you, for those who know, you know, bro. The snippet was, it just went way hard, bro. It's just the bass went way harder, bro. I, I had this shit on repeat every day, bro. This shit just sounded better, bro. The mastered version that had me tight. But anyways, I'll check you guys in the next video. My birthday's on Monday. It's lit. Peace out, guys. <laughs>